we're back with another video. It's been a while since we uploaded. We've been working really hard on the house to get it ready for summer and haven't had a time to make any videos. But exciting news, over the coming weeks, we've got plenty more videos coming, so make sure to subscribe. But even if you haven't been able to be so active on YouTube, you can still follow us on Instagram under our Italian Dream House, where we post daily content with updates from the house, with little uh, adventures we go on in the local area, and of course, plenty of footage of Ernie. And in today's episode, we will be building the walk-in closet. We take down our chicken coop after having it destroyed after a storm, and we also get an extra pair of hands from my mom um, who takes on our old rusty gate. So stay tuned.
Back for day two of building the wall. After day one, I managed to get all the framing done. Actually, it took about two and a half, three hours. I started work in the afternoon and stopped um, about five o'clock. So that wasn't too bad. Uh, it's up, it's nice and sturdy, which is amazing. Always nice to see when you haven't built a wall in many years. So today I'm going to put on some OSB paneling and then the, um, the drywall, the plasterboard is going to go on top of that. So that's today's mission. I've finished putting the plasterboard on the wall and now it's time to do a skim coat with plaster. So that's the stage I'm at. Uh, I haven't plastered since doing that wall in the bathroom and we all know how that went. So let's see how I managed to do here. Hopefully it's a bit easier because everything is uh, flat and yeah, should be much easier to pull off a good job or at least an acceptable job. So let's get on with it. Last step of finishing up the walk-in closet before we can put in the chest of drawers that we are going to use to custom build um, like a unit. Um, we're going to paint the border and we took some inspiration from our friends at uh, Blue Residence, Kashina Blue, you should follow them on Instagram. Um, they have really nice painted Piedmontese like borders instead of wooden lists. 
Um, so we asked Martin and they have 16 centimeters height. So we're going to use the Kawit laser, good amount of tape, um, and just try to get it as straight as possible. Let's do it. Got the tape. In the next video, that chicken coop demolition we promised and also the gate and garage door restoration. So make sure to subscribe and check back in for those videos. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next one.